Just a few minutes ago, I was checking for college football news on ESPN and came across some horrific news, especially if you're a parent. I have a 24-year-old and a 21-year-old, but for any of us, at any time to try to process uh, somebody losing their life at the age of 19, uh, Posted by uh, Mark Schlebach, ESPN senior writer. Utah running back Ty Jordan has died. The school announced on Saturday. The Denton Police Department in Texas told ESPN that its officers responded to a shooting call at 10.38 p.m. Eastern Time on Friday. Officers discovered a gunshot victim who had been shot one time. After applying life-saving measures... The victim was transported to a local hospital where he was pronounced deceased, 19 years old. Following a preliminary investigation, we do believe that this was an accidental shooting where the victim accidentally shot himself. Denton Police Department Public Information Officer told uh, ESPN, Utes coach Kyle Whittingham said the team is devastated. Of course. Ty's personality and smile were infectious. He made a huge impact on our program in the short time he was with us. He leaves an indelible mark on each of us, and our thoughts and prayers go out to his family and friends. From the bottom of our hearts, all of us in the Utah football family want to say we love you, Ty, and may you rest in peace. 19 years old, a freshman, just completed his uh, first season there at Utah. These football accomplishments are significant, but uh, certainly are not the reason why this is such a tragedy. But this kid could play. He was a tremendous football player. He was the Pac-12 Offensive Freshman of the Year. I got a chance to see him play against Colorado. And uh, remember that significantly in uh, being impressed with his skills, his talent, his ability is just, again, uh, just a recently named freshman of the year in the Pac-12, ran for 597 yards in the short season, a very short season for Utah in particular, six touchdowns in five games. He was all Pac-12, second team as a freshman, ranked fourth in the Pac-12 in rushing yards, third in rushing yards per game, was the first Utah freshman to have three consecutive 100-yard rushing games since 1995. Again, none of that significant to the loss of life of Ty Jordan at 19 years old. I'm sure his family and friends are devastated right now and the entire Utah football community. I only post this to uh, because when things like this happen or they're just incidents in our country and in our world, uh, then in go beyond football, we would like to make a better impact than just talking college football, which is fun and which is uh, the lifeblood of this channel and what we will continue to do. But uh, obviously, this is so much, so much more important. So just wanted to give you this opportunity that if you're connected to Utah football, just have any thoughts about the situation, thoughts about, um, you know, your own personal experiences that you leave those down in the comment section below. And uh, a tragedy in college football, Ty Jordan uh, dead at the age of 19.